and they control when you leave. Yeah. I've heard of a game called Dodge and Go. I don't know that this dog has that, but, you know, if you said, why do you have the line on it as an attempt to press it? And as an attempt to maybe complete the back end of the recall by asking. Yeah. Thing. You do want to make sure you've got a dog you know, that you can put the little shot on. Yeah. 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 Because if you said, what kind of transition, you know, do you want between on it? Not much. I say to myself, this dog doesn't know. And what I say to myself is, this dog doesn't know that we don't want the leash made tight. I don't say that this dog needs to be corrected for making the leash tight. You know? And if you think you can have a relationship with one by putting a pinch collar on a jerk, I don't think you can. I don't think you can. High drive dogs, you can use it for certain things. I mean, I understand that, but for companion dogs, no, I, I don't believe it. So I want to you know, ins install the rumble strip on the leash. I'm going to install a rumble strip. That's what you have to think of. I'm installing a rumble strip, and I'm uh, installing a, a no shoulder. So in other words, <laughs> whatever, an uneven shoulder, right off the edge. This dog has probably had a pinch collar of these like any, any large dogs that have had a history of pulling on people in the future. But he's very interesting. You know, so I want him to understand that I'm not trying to use the leash that way. You 
in it that what's that you know the pig's gonna have it on the leash too. My pretty's doing great. We'll see you soon.